Welcome back everyone to the New Jersey gardening channel. So today I just want to talk a little bit about the cool crops that we can uh, directly sow. As you can see, I have a lot of seeds. This is my guilty pleasure. Uh, if I have extra money, I will be running down to the store and getting more seeds. And also Cooper wants to say hi. <laughs> and so um, what we have today is and what we can be directly sown is this fall crops and more uh, importantly there's a couple crops that we definitely want to directly sown and not disturb uh, because they don't like to be transplanted so one of them is the radishes these radishes they don't like to be transplanted so you have to uh, direct sow them into the ground as well as cilantro beets especially carrots and these crops over here you can uh, start them before but you can also direct sow them into the ground and we have here this this baby snaps or green snaps why did I forget the name well you guys see the picture then we have our broccoli uh, we have our green beans and whorehound. I don't know if you guys uh, ever heard about this plant, but back in the day, people used to use it as a cold remedy. So you can boil it and have a little bit of tea, or they used to have it, make it in candies. I guess kind of like a cough drop, but uh, this is a perennial and it comes back every year. So if you want to have this plant, uh, just know that there is a possibility that it's going to come back and we can direct sow this into the ground. Another thing would be cabbage. Then we have chives, and who doesn't like chives? We also have bunch in, uh, onions. Then we have some black garden beans. So I'm looking forward to sowing out of everything here. I have not sown that one. Uh, I have sown everything else except for that one, so I'm curious to see what how it's going to turn out. Then we have our Swiss chard here. Also kale. I believe I already have the video of how to sew that. But if there's another video that you guys would like to see how I saw it, uh, you can leave a comment in the bottom and then I will surely try to make that video or I will just explain to you in a comment on how to sew it directly. Then we also have our lettuce here. Lettuce is the easiest. I have to say lettuce and uh, radishes are the easiest. And they don't, they don't take a long time. Um, I would say they take about three weeks to a month for them to mature. Then we have our spinach. So if you guys have any of this at home and you wanna try it, um, the soil is it's ready for them to be directly sown. So you can start them inside. I'm sorry, you can start them right now in directly into the, into the ground. Uh, there is other crops, um, like I said, that you can put them later, but for now, this is something that we can directly sow into the ground. So that's all for today, guys. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Take care. Bye.